Howdy and happy back day. We're gonna take a staple rear deltoid exercise and modify it to put some meat on your upper back. The rhomboids are the primary muscle worked here. If you don't know where those are, I don't blame you because you can't see them. They lie underneath the lower traps and contribute to the upper back thickness. We'll also use a little lats, rear delts, and even biceps here, but the objective is to train and develop the rhomboids and lower traps. These muscle groups work together to extend and retract your shoulder blades. Heavy seated bent over lateral raises can be classified as midway between a high row and a bent over lateral raise for the rear deltoids. But instead of keeping your arms straight and slightly ahead of your shoulders, which is how you target the rear deltoids, we're going to modify the form to target the upper mid back. Pick a weight somewhere around five times heavier than what you use for bent over laterals. Sit on a bench where you'll have the most power. A weight belt isn't a bad idea either, which will allow you to brace your core and keep you in a strong lifting position throughout this exercise. Do not lock your arms in place. Allow them to bend slightly without turning it into a curl. Keeping your head and eyes up, take a deep breath and exhale with each contraction. Begin with your shoulder blades, relax and completely stretched out as far as possible. Explosively contract your upper back to retract your shoulder blades as if you were trying to slam your shoulder blades together. Think of your shoulder blades as two dinner plates that you're trying to slam together so hard they'll break. Pause slightly at the top, then lower the weight slowly to the starting position and begin the next rep. The overall range of motion is relatively short. This requires extra attention to your tempo. Each rep should take one second to lift and three seconds to lower. Your upper back is made up of mostly fast twitch fibers, so make sure you're failing in the eight to 12 rep range, which allows you to lift a heavy enough weight for the exercise to be effective, but you're also working the muscles for a solid 40 to 50 seconds to promote adequate blood flow. Make sure you're getting your rest, getting fed with the right nutrition, staying hydrated, and watch that back get thicker and thicker every week. Thank you for watching. Hit that back double bicep pose. Share with your training partner if this helped. God bless, and we'll catch you in the next workout.